briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Supreme Court of Appeals of West Virginia heard a case in 1998, Stevens v. Kasdorf, which centered on the proper execution of a will. The Stevenses, nieces of Homer Haskell Miller, challenged the legality of his will, arguing it wasn't executed according to the law. Miller's will, which left most of his estate to the Kasdorfs, was signed at a bank and witnessed by two bank employees who didn't actually see him sign it. The circuit court initially approved the Kasdorfs' countermotion for summary judgment, but the Stevenses appealed the decision. The court found that the will was not properly executed according to the law, as it required a will to be in writing, signed by the testator, and witnessed by two competent witnesses who also signed the will in the presence of the testator and each other. As a result, the court reversed the circuit court's decision, granting the appeal request and overturning the approval of the Kasdorf's counter-motion for summary judgment. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.